Fish on. What is this? This is not a fish. There's no way this is a fish. What did I just catch? What's going on everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here and welcome back to another fishing adventure. Lay on down and I hit the lights. Close my eyes on a quiet night. Half in a dream and a sleep in ten. I hear little drops on my windowsill. I've got something fun planned for today's episode, but first I'm gonna head out to one of my favorite spillways, and once I get out there, I'll tell you guys exactly what's going on. I've got two goals for today. Goal number one, I would like to catch a big fish out of this spillway. Now as far as goal number two, I would like to do a catch and cook on the banks of this spillway. I've never done anything like this, and I'm excited. To do this catch and cook, I actually recently purchased this cool little kit off of Amazon. It's basically everything you need in one little package. I've got a pot and I've got a pan, and then inside of here, I've got a little portable burner. And inside of here, I've got some little micro utensils. Now, as far as what I'll be cooking, I honestly have no idea. Let's just see what we catch. I've got a couple of bait options. I brought some frozen bluegill. And I also brought, you guys guessed it, some night crawlers. All right, I've got a night crawler rigged up. Here we go. She is the star and the car that proceeds. A howling wind and a still air in between. Oh, there's a bike. There we go, fish on. What is this? This feels like a nice fish, guys. I have not seen it yet. Oh my gosh. Holy cow, you guys. This is a nice drum. Dang, these fish fight hard. Yes, there we go. <laughs> Doggy, that did not take long at all. Caught me a nice drum on the night crawler. I would like to try freshwater drum, but this guy is a little bit big and I'm honestly not that hungry right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this guy go and see what else I can catch. See you later, buddy. It's been a while since I casted out this catfish rod. Let's see if I still have my bait. All right, the bait is gone. So let's, uh, let's get another piece out there. On my third rod, I'm gonna rig it up in my automatic hook setter to see what I can catch using this. Oh, you guys, I'm getting bites on that automatic hook setter. For some reason, it's not tripping. Something's down there. Here we go, guys. Fish on. Oh my gosh. Holy cow, you guys. Is this a yellow bass? I don't think I've ever caught a yellow bass this big. Holy smokes. He went for a piece of bluegill. There is a fish on this rod over here. I'm gonna quickly let this guy go. See you later, buddy. Something's on here. Fish on. What is it? Oh, it's another drum. Ugh. Yes. Second freshwater drum. A little bit smaller than that first one. 
This guy swallowed the hook, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep this guy. I've never used a little camping stove like this, so this should be uh, pretty interesting. Looks like you just screw this on the top of this bad boy, hopefully. How in the world does this thing work? I guess I probably should have researched this before coming out here. I'm turn this lever to here. It's such simple. All right, guys, while the pan heats up, I'm gonna fillet up this fish. Unfortunately, I forgot to bring a fillet knife, so I'm gonna be using my bait knife, and I also don't have a cutting board, so this is already turning out to be a pretty big fail, but here we go. After a brutal fillet job with this dull knife, I was able to get a decent amount of meat. So I'm gonna clean it off, get it on the skillet, and see how it tastes. As far as seasoning goes, I, I don't have any. I actually forgot it. So we're gonna see what freshwater drum tastes without any seasoning. I did, however, remember some nonstick spray. All right, that pan is hot, holy cow. Here we go. The meat actually looks really good. It's, it's a very white meat. There are some bones in there, but I'm actually pretty optimistic. All right, it's looking like it's almost done. I wanna make sure I cook this all the way through. But it's actually looking really good. It's got some really flaky white meat on there. I'm excited to try this out. All right, guys, I think it is done. I'm actually surprised. It looks a lot better than what I was expecting. First catch and cook on the banks of a spillway. Here we go. That's actually really good. It's a really white flaky meat. I was not expecting it to taste this good.
I've not come across one bone yet. I am very surprised. This was a lot better than what I was expecting, especially seeing the water that that fish came out of. But in the end, he actually tasted really good. And that's with no seasoning. So if I had a little butter, some seasoning, this would have been delicious, but it's actually not that bad on its own. Freshwater drum, pretty dang good guys. Highly recommend trying it out if you haven't. This is my first time having it and I was pleasantly surprised. I had two goals for today. One of those goals is completed. Now it's time to try to catch a big spillway fish. Here we go guys, something has it. Fish on. Not sure what it is yet, it's fighting hard though. Holy cow, you guys. This fish is fighting really hard. Oh my gosh. Please stay on. I'm not exactly sure what this is yet. Holy cow. Freshwater drum. It's a nice one. Oh. There we go. Yes. They get a lot bigger than this, but holy smokes, you guys. This is one of the biggest ones I've caught. Hopefully I'll be able to catch a truly big freshwater drum, but these little ones, they still fight really hard. See you later, buddy. Fish on. What is this? This is not a fish. There's no way this is a fish. What did I just catch? Oh no, it's a turtle. Oh my gosh. It's caught me a big turtle, guys. All right, buddy. Let's get you unhooked. There you go. See you later, buddy. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Oh, it's another drum. <sighs> there we go. I think I'm actually going to keep this drum for future catfish bait. What in the world? Oh, I think it's a white bass. All right, let's rig this guy up as live bait and see if we can catch a monster. All right, guys, secret bait. I'm going to use the uh, intestines, I'm not sure of that freshwater drum that I caught earlier. Oh, fish on. What is this? It feels heavy. It picked it up, it didn't even move. Oh, it's a catfish.
Yes. Decent little channel cat. See you later, buddy. Unfortunately, nothing big was biting out of the spillway today. I tried my best, but I was not able to catch any sizable fish, but I still had a lot of fun. I was able to catch some pretty decent freshwater drum, and I was able to try out my new mobile on-the-go cooking station. So if you guys liked this episode, I'd really appreciate it if you left a thumbs up, but I'm gonna head out of here. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. I will catch you in the next one. Holy cow, you guys.